Ugh. Hi guys. <laughs> this is probably gonna be a whole video of me crying. But it's something I should make, so I'm gonna make it. <laughs> Look ridiculous right now. Um, okay, so basically I had a very long day. Um my nutcracker is next week. So we had our dress rehearsal today. Um, um, we had our dress rehearsal today and I thought it went well. Um, and I thought it was all good and everything. And then I saw the video and I like broke down because I hate myself so much. <laughs> Oh, sorry. I have just really haven't been this negative in a while. I was doing really, really well. <laughs> I was doing really well. <laughs> um, it's just kind of ruined everything. I hate my body. I hate that I look so fat in the video. Um, I hate my feet. I hate my leg shape. I hate my arms that are fat, I hate my hands, they're weird, I hate literally everything about myself. When I watch that video, I literally don't even know who I am anymore. I don't see one thing I like about myself. My mom is in Indonesia, so I don't have her, and I'm just home alone, <laughs> crying. So I picked up my camera, because I'm sure a lot of you guys can relate, I hope, or I'm just being stupid. Now I'm getting 10 million texts. Um, so I had my dress rehearsal. I thought it went really well. Um, and then I watched my other cast do it. So the girl opposite me. And just so envious. She has like the most perfect body you've ever seen. The most perfect feet. Everything was beautiful. Like the costume looked great. She did all her whatever turns and whatever. And. I just felt so shitty about myself. I'm comparing myself like crazy. It's just so damaging. It really ruins your whole day. And I just wanted to kind of show you what the low parts of ballet are right now because it's not always graceful and beautiful as you can see. It literally looks so stupid. Like my mindset is so negative right now. Like if I was so skinny, I'd be happy. Literally, that's all it would take. There's not one thing in my dance thing that I like. I hate everything. Like, I look at these videos, and I can look at every other girl in the room, and I can see how beautiful they look, and everything that looks great on them, and I look at myself, and everything is wrong. Like, it's wrong. And I don't even want to be a ballet dancer. Like, I don't even want that. So why am I beating myself up about it? I don't know. I just wanted to sit and tell you that it's not always great. People like me and many others um are insecure i don't i don't know if i look really confident on the outside i'm not <laughs> um i just want you to know that you're not alone if you feel the same way as me right now and i will get better and i'm trying to get better i really am i don't want you guys to be worried about me i'm not i don't have an eating disorder i'm fine I just hate my body. <laughs> I have body dysmorphia, I guess. I just wanted to make this video because you guys are the only ones here right now. I don't have my mom here right now. I don't have my family with me, so I have you guys, and that's enough. I already feel better, honestly. As you can see, I was kind of a mess at the beginning of this video, but looking a little better. I'm gonna work on it because I have a show next week. If I'm not 100% confident, I'm not gonna perform the way I want to. And I'm gonna not watch any videos ever because I'm over it. I'm so over it. I don't wanna be so negative anymore. I just wanna be happy and I don't know what it's gonna take for me to be happy, but I know that it's not this right now. All right, so we did not get anywhere actually. I'm still a mess. If you're a ballerina out there and you feel the same way, you're not alone. I'm right here with you struggling and I want to talk about it and hopefully we can deal with it together. 
Um, it's so common. And even from non-ballerinas, I'm sure it's common. It's so crazy in the world we live in. How perfect you need to be these days. And social media. It's seeing, waking up every single morning, scrolling through your Instagram. I, I feel like shit every time I leave Instagram. I see one girl on Instagram that I want to be like and I feel like shit. I don't think I've ever left Instagram feeling good. Like, ever. And it's so damaging. And every morning, you know, watching YouTube, watching freaking Romy Strite vlogs where she's eating, like, two carrots. Why am I eating ice cream? <laughs> it's, like, all comparison and envy. And I just want to, like, be my own person. Um, I'm going to go call all the people that are calling me right now that I love so much that are reaching out. Um, if you guys don't have a person like that and you're dealing with this alone, please DM me. I work my hardest to answer my DMs on my Instagram because I know that a lot of you guys are dealing with the same thing and if I can come on here on YouTube and make a video that can help someone out there, then <laughs> I have purpose and this won't happen to me as much. And it's truly amazing when you guys comment that you guys can relate or you DM me that you deal with the same stuff. It makes me feel more normal and it makes me feel like we can all get through this one day. Um, I know you guys have never seen me in this state, but I want to be open with you guys because who am I to just put on a perfect front all the time and not show you my real self. Um, I love you guys so much and I promise you I'm going to get better and I hope that all of you guys are going to get better too. And that's it. <laughs> I love you. Alright. Bye.